So we're here, it's uh, day 17 of the Douglas Garland triple murder trial. Uh, it started back January 16th, and in that time, in the, the few weeks, we've all been sitting here listening to some pretty horrific and uh, graphic evidence uh, laid out by the Crown. Uh, there's been uh, a lot of stress uh, for the jurors at one point. Uh, jurors had to take a break when they saw uh, aerial photographs uh, appeared to show photos of, uh, of the victims on the farm. Today was an interesting day for the fact that there was, if, if I can dare say the word, a little bit of levity and moments of laughter, partly because the young woman uh, on the stand for much of the morning uh, uh, Constable um, Jamie Parhar, uh, the young rookie uh, officer, very self-deprecating humor, but she also had a really incredible story to share about how she became a rather uh, surprising uh, instrumental player in the uh, arrest of Douglas Garland on July 14th, uh, 2014 on his farm. She um, was called in on a night shift. Uh, her and her partner and another female officer volunteered to help out uh, reinforcements up in Airdrie, an area that she didn't even know the terrain of Airdrie, let alone the rural area around that, to uh, basically kind of do a traffic stop of, of Garland and uh, in his rental car. Well, she ends up, her and the young officer, getting in their uh, Crown Victoria police car, driving through these fields over ruts and potholes and come to a stop finally at a barbed wire fence. They run out, they get separated, and it's this uh, young 24-year-old at the time, a uh, female officer new to the job, chasing through the trees and the darkness, uh, a murder suspect, a triple murder suspect, a man who knows this terrain very well. Uh, she made some jokes about her physical fitness, things like that, but I also think that part, uh, part of it was just the, uh, her personality and the fact that we finally come around to um, talking about the apprehension of a suspect in a, a, a horrific uh, triple murder. And uh, after hearing everything else, it was like some of the laughter was like a sigh of relief.